super tortas guys welcome to chihuahua mexico the biggest state in mexico we're gonna go here and try the tortas a torta is basically a mexican sandwich and what i've noticed is so far each state seems to have different variations things change the recipe changes so we're gonna go here and check it out Alrighty, this place looks like it's happening. Check it out. Buenas. Esas son las tortas. Alright, they look massive. It looks like they have a brisket torta, guys. So, we're connected to Texas here. And I know there's some good brisket in Texas. So it looks like they make their own here with the torta. Buenas tardes. Este, estoy aquí por primera vez en Chihuahua. ¿Qué me dices tú que es la torta que tengo que probar acá? La super torta, pierna, jamón, queso y aguacate. Perdón, la super, super torta. Ajá. Pierna, jamón, queso y aguacate. Ok, y vi una también con brisket. ¿Es algo de especialidad de acá o...? El brisket es carne de cebrada con sazonador ahumado. No es especialidad, pero sí está muy buena. Está. También la torta de milanes es muy buena. So, ¿Cuál es la típica acá de Chihuahua? Super torta. Super torta. Pierna. Bueno, ¿Y pierna. eso viene con qué? ¿Pierna? Pierna, jamón, queso y aguacate. Ok, una de esas entonces, por favor. ¿Y tienen gorditas? Gorditas de harina con algún guisado a escoger. Estos son nuestros guisados, jóvenes. Una gordita con frijoles y queso, por favor. No, ¿Qué más? Eh, ¿La gordita la tienes? Sí. Ok, ¿esto qué es? Limonada natural. Natural, oh sí, mira, hasta tiene la pulpa. Una de esas, por favor. La limonada. Y algo más que recomiendes así súper típico que no me papas puedo perder. Papas francesas. Y papas francesas, por favor. Ok, papas francesas para la francesa. Vamos. Eh, eso es todo. 160, joven. There's people coming in and out. That is a good sign for good food. That means there's a lot of movement going on. The food is going to be fresh. Just to give you guys a heads up, a couple hours from here is Juarez. It's a border city. And that is where burritos were invented. So it's a big deal, the burritos over here in Chihuahua, Mexico. Alrighty. Hey guys, this place, you know, it's just one of those places when you see people walking in non stop, you're in a good place. I said it's price. <laughs> I know, not All local. Right. Papas a la Francesa. When I asked her what are the typical things, she was like, oh, papas a la Francesa yeah. is our thing over here. Why not? Let's, looks hot, but it's. Oh, right. right, here's the gordita with frijoles. Like regular fries, not um, regular fries, not fresh cut. No, <laughs> yeah, no, I saw them, they came yeah. from the back. They're yeah. frozen. <laughs> right. What is that? That's a gordita with cheese. Oh, yeah, there are a lot of furrowless, more furrowless than cheese. <laughs> I'll, I'll give it a go. Me dicen que este lugar es muy bueno. Es tu primera vez acá? No, no, siempre vienes. 
¿Las mejores tortas de Chihuahua o...? Sí. ¿Sí, aquí? Ok. Vamos a ver, pues. Oh, the French is going in for the gordita. It's perilous, but like it's seasoned really differently. It tastes really good. Right, it's I, don't know, with I don't know what they put in it, but really well seasoned. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, love it. Eh, ella es de Francia y yo de Miami. ¿Y ustedes? De aquí. De aquí de Chihuahua, pero primera vez que vienen acá. No, no. Oh, siempre vienen. ¿Y son buenas acá? Sí. Bueno, me dijeron que tengo que probar esta, la super torta. Sí. Es la propia. Sí. Está bien. Vamos a ver, pues. Okay. You like the gordita? All right, guys. I'm gonna unbox this goodness over here, and all right, Sofonir is gonna help. Look, it just comes out. Oh, the bread is good. Yeah, the bread looks exquisite. If we open it up, tomato, looks like I put some mayonnaise, lettuce, guacamole, ham, oh, and the pierna. It's gonna be pork based. All right, guys. Oh, this snuck up on my table. Check it out carrots and chilies. Get rid of this. And we're gonna try it. Ooh, I don't know if I mentioned, but there's some cheese here. Guys, the sandwich is, the bread is very soft. It's toasty. It's full of flour everywhere. But, you know, it's just toasted to perfection. It's nice and warm. You could, you could pretty much put your finger through this thing. I'm not kidding. I'm not gonna do it because I don't wanna mess up my torta. But that's the vibe, guys. And like I told you, the tortas are not the same everywhere in Mexico. They change from state to state. So I'm extremely excited. Let's get this guy a go. Mm. Mm. Oh Lord. Guys, we have a hit here. This meat, this pork meat is extremely soft. It's been shredded up. Oh my goodness. And it is super tasty. The avocado in here is complementing things very well. I'm gonna go for another bite and I'm gonna add a chili to it. It's a beautiful chili because it's hot right away and you think that it's gonna be very hot but it's not very hot on a scale of one through ten i'm gonna give the chili a score of a, a three almost a four if you're very sensitive you will feel it but i like that i felt it and then you know things didn't elevate to a point that is just extremely extremely hot and i really really like that now i'm gonna do a, a bigger bite i'm gonna try the carrot with the chili as well Mm. That bite was more refreshing. The carrot is really cool and cold. And it kind of refreshes your mouth. Oh, now I got the chili bite in there. Mm. Big fan of these chilies. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to find out what kind of chilies they are. I don't have to tell you guys that it's really hot in Chihuahua. We're in the desert. Mm. Pure lime in here pure lemon whatever delicious homemade lemonade man yeah man i 100 percent approve this place it is delicious i'm sorry that i couldn't i wanted to film more when they were preparing the sandwich but the covid measures in chihuahua are taken very seriously so i couldn't get back there in the kitchen but yeah we have some ninja sandwich makers back there making these here's the price guys the torta is basically 74 pesos so we can just say it's three dollars and 75 cents 
the gordita was a dollar the fries are two dollars and the lemonade about a buck fifty so the grand total was eight dollars usd look at the pigeons going crazy for the tortillas Amiga, muy muy sabrosa las tortas, increíble. Muchísimas gracias. gracias. Sabrosísima. Gracias. A ti. ¿Puedo hacer la página, joven? ¿Perdón? La página. ¿Eh, ¿Tienes tu celular? No, no, no lo tenemos aquí. Te la... Este, amigo, ¿cómo se llama el chile este que están dando ahí? Curtido. Curtido, si son típicos de acá. Pues sí. Ok. Tengan pues buen provecho. Que la pasen bien, pues. Hasta luego. Bye bye. Alrighty, guys. Time to roll out, guys. What a place. Let me show you guys exactly where it is because I feel like you guys have to try this place if you're ever here in Chihuahua. So, we're in the central. The, the big colorful Chihuahua words are over there and the cathedral's over there. So, you just follow this street here and you're gonna find... I mean, you can't miss it. It's the beautiful sandwich there. Super tortas, guys. What makes this sandwich stand out is that bread. It's perfect, you know, you need a good bread to have such a good sandwich, like at least to have such an extraordinarily good sandwich. And then the meat, the pierna, oh Lord, that is where it's at, you know, the ham, all that, the cheese, I didn't really even barely taste the cheese in there. You just, the flavor of this pierna meat takes over and then the guacamole in there and then the freshness and softness of this bread. Man, this sandwich was just packing some major heat. That was delicious. And the chilies were good too. I like the chilies I found here. Alrighty. Wow. Let me show you guys a quick 360 of how it looks. This is Chihuahua, Mexico. The capital of the state of Chihuahua, the biggest one. Mexico's biggest state, named after one of the smallest dogs, Little Chihuahua, but mighty Little Chihuahua. All right, guys, I'm talking too much. Vlog is over.